what's up guys it is Monday evening and I just uploaded my vlog and Victor and I and gremlin are gonna go out to eat right now gremlin safe and sound gremlin is safe and sound so I'm doing keto Victor is like doing low carb because he's like I'm doing keto too but I'm having a little bit of bread and I was like mm. <laughs> You're like, does that keep you in ketosis? I was like, no. I didn't want to seem like I know it all. <laughs> but I was like, I don't think bread on keto. I don't think you can have that. And then my routine every Monday when I upload a vlog is to just read all the comments and get in my feels and reply to comments. So after we eat, I'm probably just going to go home, chill, and do that. I was, uh, I couldn't even wait. So I already took a bite of this. But we're at Tender Greens. And I got the backyard steak plate with salad and seasonal veggies and I donated my corn and um, toast to Victor Elote. <laughs> so I tried to make those stupid cookie keto cookie dough balls again last night what a fail all right we messed it up this is this has turned into the nastiest keto cookie recipe ever Alan's said to put milk in. It needs some milk. And then from that point, it just kept getting worse and worse. Just throwing more and more almond flour in there. Uh, an egg. Wait, you added egg to this? You're not gonna cook it? <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it at that, yeah. You want a salmonella cookie, huh? <laughs> I thought you can eat raw eggs. Who are you, fucking Rocky? All right, I don't know why we're even doing this, but um, middle rack, middle row? Yeah, middle for sure. <laughs> Verdict? <laughs> no. You know, they looked normal. They looked normal. That's really bad. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Don't <do the> roll. <laughs> oh, my oh, oh, oh. I didn't think they could be that gross. Just really uh, having a hard time nailing that recipe. <laughs> I'm headed into the gym right now. I saw lots of encouraging comments about intermittent fasting. Um, so you guys kind of, I, I don't know, you guys kind of opened me up to being like, all right, don't like shut the door on that forever. Maybe it didn't work right now, but maybe I'll give things a shot again. And I saw some people were saying to maybe just try it like Monday through Friday, Monday through, through Thursday even, or adjust the hours to when I'm going to sleep. So yeah, I just want to avoid eating late and I really want to just not overdo it, don't eat until I'm super full, just uh, be like a normal person. I didn't even get to film my workout, but believe me when I tell you that my trainer was trying to kill me today. I just felt so sick, I felt like I was going to throw up, I still feel like I'm going to throw up. I am going to buy more almond flour since I wasted all of the almond flour I had last night in the struggle kitchen. So this is my Starbucks. I got venti iced coffee with four pumps of sugar-free vanilla and heavy cream. I have no idea what I'm checking for when I do this. I don't know what I did with it. And back from the grocery store. I don't have a lot of time. I have to hurry up, hop in the shower, and uh, run to an appointment. So I'm gonna have half of an avocado, put some tahini on there, just cause it's quick and easy. And we will save this one for later today. You guys, I wanna show you Gremlin's new trick. Come here. Cheat. Gremlin, roll over. <laughs> Good girl. Just got back from my appointment. I meant to show you guys this before I ate half of it, but. I'm snacking on a little string cheese. In addition to my little string cheese, this is also a little snack I made, very humble. Um, just some uh, soggy iceberg lettuce with some turkey and I put a piece of salami on there and I put ranch on there because I ain't even playing games today. 
I know lunch meat is not the best for you, but it's quick and easy, and I promise to do better in the future, but not today. Thank you, bye. It's like 6 p.m. I'm not really sure what I'm doing for dinner yet, so I'm gonna have this snack. I'm gonna have half an avocado, and I put some tahini on there, and then I'm gonna have some kimchi too. And I'm also gonna have a couple raspberries. Okay, so I'm having this little snack. Um, roasted almonds, actually, these are actually from the airplane. And I just had them in my bag and I'm a little bit hungry. I haven't eaten dinner yet, so I'm just snacking on these. Thank you. Um, I ate kind of late, but I didn't eat. I ate a pretty small portion. I should have showed you guys at the end, but I didn't eat a lot of it, but I was like super hungry. But I kind of just ate the part with the cheese. So yeah, I have my workout tomorrow at 11. And yeah. Today is, oh wow, it's Friday. <sighs> I had some crazy shit go down yesterday that uh, I didn't vlog all day yesterday. It's nothing that I need to include in the vlog. It really, it didn't have anything to do with like any like eating or like any of like my health journey. It was just some other crazy stuff um, that I wasn't able to vlog, but Everything is all good in the hood. Today though, I'm headed into the gym to squat. I'm super late right now. <clears throat> I haven't weighed myself since like Monday, I think, but I'm feeling good. Like I, f I'm f I feel like I'm getting a little smaller or like I'm just, I don't know, my stomach feels a little smaller. I know it's not like a huge change, but for me like feeling good, I don't know, I just feel good. I feel like I'm on the right track, so that's good. Do it. Very good. Very 
Very good. I just wrapped up lunch. I got the kelp noodles, which I looked up on my like little keto app. It said that they have, or most brands have like zero grams of net carbs. And then it was like with a pesto, I don't know, like nut sauce and arugula. And it was really, really good. And I added some avocado to it. So I ate about half of that. I also had some buffalo cauliflower that was really, really good. Um, yeah, and then I had a glass of wine. So it's, oh my gosh, it's already almost 11. You... <laughs> okay, it's 10. <laughs> the, the clock on my oven was wrong. Um, I'm just like super tired. I ended up eating the other half of my um, salad earlier. And right now I'm like kind of hungry. I want to eat something, but I'm like, I don't know. Should I like postmate some chicken wings? Because you know I can have like chicken wings, like buffalo chicken wings and ranch. But I'm like, oh, that's going to like be hella expensive, take a long time to get here, probably eat more than I would if I just eat at home. So I don't know. I'm going to look in my fridge right now. I like don't feel like making anything. This is my fridge. Um, we have an empty box of sparkling water, some cheese, a cider that I can't have, some jelly that I can't have, gremlins food, eggs, beef. Sour cream, pickles, are they, is this empty? I don't know, there's two left in there. <laughs> Some jalapenos, parmesan, cream cheese. This is a this is a shake. I mean, I'm sorry, what the hell? This is a um, mask, face mask. Put that over there. I got some tapatio, tomatoes, turkey, um, raspberries, kimchi, some spinach and lettuce. There's some more lettuce in there. I got some bacon. Basically just like cheese, but I just don't feel like eating any of this. Slim pickings here. I said I said I was gonna go to the grocery store. I did not make it to the grocery store. I feel like nine out of ten times I say I'm going to the grocery store, I probably won't make it. So I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. What's up guys? So the good thing about last night is that I did not order Postmates. The bad thing is that my little brother shows up at my place at like midnight with his friend. We ended up opening some wine, drinking, and hanging out until like 3 a.m. So the bad news is I had a lot of wine. So today is Alan's birthday. I got a bunch of running around right now to do. I have to go. He gets spray tan, dude. I am so pale. <laughs> <laughs> top of my priority list so I need to get a spray tan I need to buy him a cake drop it off at the restaurant and then buy him a gift so I got a boogie I got my tan on I already feel better um next we gotta go find a cake gross but I'm just like hella hungry it's three o'clock 3 30 actually and I haven't eaten yet so when I went to Starbucks I picked up my regular coffee order and then I ordered like the one of the breakfast sandwiches I think it was like the bacon and gouda and I'm just eating it without the bread I mean it's probably pretty processed not the best for me but I just needed something or I wanted something so I went to buy Alan an, an espresso machine because he likes to make espressos and I'm immediately overwhelmed and I don't get it. They're kind of expensive so I'm like should I just <laughs> save that one for another time and get him something else? I'm so kitchen incompetent it's not even funny 
And like, okay, I see these, I'm looking at these stupid Nespresso machines. It says you can make coffee or espresso. I'm like, bitch, I only see one button. All right, so Alan is not getting an espresso machine. And now it's just like, I need to figure out a gift ASAP because I need to go home and get ready. Alrighty, mission accomplished. Handled everything I needed to handle. Now I'm about to do my makeup and get ready for tonight. And I wanna look cute tonight. It's been a while since I've wanted to look cute. How cute is this cake that was made for my little brother's birthday? You can just tell it was made with love. So much pressure, it's really quiet. I feel like there's a lot of pressure on me right now. You're wearing those at dinner, 100%. They're fire. <laughs> <laughs> It is like 5 p.m. I, I have to admit I'm hungover right now. Um, but, you know, there's been birthday cake in my house staring at me all day. But I am not going to go off the keto diet. But I did get some pretty tasty keto stuff. I'm going to put out some goodbyes for a moment. That's fucking I wonder how strict they are too. So this is what I ordered. I took off the croutons and the bread. And if it looks gross, it's because it probably is. I made a bad choice on Postmates. These are the chicken wings. They, they, they could be I, but yeah. So my total weight loss for this week well, actually, I didn't lose any weight. When I weighed in, the scale actually went up one pound since last Sunday. It's super frustrating because I felt like I was getting smaller. Like, I felt like my clothes were fitting better. But then I was also like, dude, I drank on Wednesday. I did not drink on Thursday, but then Friday and Saturday. And so, I don't know, doing this vlog is actually forcing me to really examine myself and my habits and look at what I'm doing. So I think what happened was like last week I made progress and I was feeling so good. And instead of like keeping that up, I was just like, oh, I can like slack off a little bit and I need to stop doing that. I do that all the time with dieting, like I think so short term. And so I just need to think more long term, like, like this is something that I'm gonna keep up for the rest of my life is e healthy eating habits. And I just need to have better balance because I was not balanced this week and it, and it showed. This is tough for me, you guys, it really is because Every single week, I want to have like a good answer for you guys. I want to have progress. And when I don't, I feel like I'm really letting myself down and, you know, potentially letting you guys down, which is a shitty feeling. But next week, I'm pretty sure I'm going to have a nutritionist on so we can really look at keto, see what I'm doing there. 
And then also I want to do another body scan so I can look at my body fat and muscle and just see how much prog progress I've made there as well. And I'm not going to drink next week. Like I need to get back into like the very focused, responsible, in control mind state. Anyways, I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching. Please, please know that I'm not going to give up. I will never give up. And that if you're working towards your goals, when you have little dips in the road, just keep going. Because that's what I'm going to keep doing too. I love you guys. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.